Hi guys, Saiz here, back with another interesting and most important video. And in this video, I'm going to talk about how to install any latest Android version custom ROMs on your Redmi Note 10 Pro or 10 Pro Max. In this video, I'm going to cover full step by step guide. So don't skip any part of this video. Watch this video till then. And if you're new on this channel, then don't forget to subscribe. Also join our Telegram channel where I provide important files and updates. So without any wasting of time, let's begin. Okay guys, before we move on installation of any custom ROM, first important thing which we need to need that, which is you need to unlock your device bootloader. If you not in unlock your device bootloader, so must first unlock your device bootloader. And how to unlock any Xiaomi Redmi Poco device bootloader? I already made one video on this topic. You can check that video. I will provide link on description. Okay, so first unlock your device bootloader. After that, you can came on this video. Okay, let's talk about uh, which important files you need to download. Okay, let's talk about it. Okay, open Telegram application. If you not log in, then log in on Telegram application. Okay. Then open Telegram and you need to uh, join one channel of Redmi Note 10 Pro or 10 Pro Max. So here it is the update channel. I will give link on description so you will easily get this channel or group. So I am searching this on search bar. So here it is the two channels is came. Uh, I mean three photograph channel, chat channel, discuss channel. Okay, chat and discuss channel is same. But we need to uh, join our uh, ch channel actually. So where you get channel? Uh, wait, this is the discuss group where you can ask files and talk with another peoples. And here it is the as you can see, this is the actually channel where you get latest upgraded ROMs, kernels and recovery files and other files. Okay, so I'm going to install any latest standard version ROM. For example purpose, I am going to install um, which ROM. So here it is a lot of ROMs is here. You can install any ROM. So let's install this project infinity. So here it is the 3.1 version is latest on I'm recording this video, but actually latest version already released like uh, 3.4 I think. So download latest Android version custom ROM, which you like or which you want to install. For example purpose, I like this custom ROM, which is project infinity X. Okay, where a banking application is also working fine because integrity support is games in other ROMs also is games, but this ROM I like. So that's why I'm going to install this latest ROM. So you can download ROM, then also must read flashing guide. It's very important and mandatory. This is very important. Okay. And if your device on old version software, so before you going to install any custom ROM, please update your device first. Okay. In my case, my device is on MIUI 13, but actually for installing this ROM, we need MIUI 14 firmware. So upgrade your device. I mean company software, update your company software, company stock ROM. After that, good to go to install latest Android custom ROMs. You can read flashing guide where all the things are mentioned like uh, first of all your device must on latest firmware, this, this files is required to install this ROM. Like this all the things are mentioned on flashing guide. So where you get flashing guide, also I will show you where you down going to download your ROM on that place flashing guide is also mentioned. Okay, so here it is the latest version is available. Now one confusion is came what is G apps vari version or variant or what is vanilla vari uh, version variant. So listen, G apps version means where all the Google applications is schemes like Google Play Store is available and all uh, some Google apps are available. And vanilla version means there is no Google Play Store and there there is no Google apps is present. So better if you go with Google apps. So you need to download G apps version. Don't download vanilla version. Note this point. Then here it is. As you can see, flashing guide is mentioned here. So read flashing guide. Flashing guide is mentioned on ROM website or in telegram channel where you are going to download your ROM. Okay. So in my case, here it is, as you can see, uh, flashing guide is mentioned. Now talking about how to install custom ROM. Okay. Download all the required files, like which files we need. One is ROM custom recovery 
and uh, if they said latest firmware then definitely download latest firmware and install it or you can up, um, what we call upgrade your device through OTA okay now connect your device on fast boot mode if you previously unlock your device bootloader then you definitely know how connect your device on fast boot mode after that uh, when you connect your device with fast boot mode here it is one important file which you need to download which is platform tools this is in the zip format download it extract it after that you will get a folder now next important file which is uh, rom so in my case i am going to install project infinity rom and recovery which mentioned which is orange fox recovery i will give all the file link on description so extract orange fox recovery zip file and you will get this recovery image copy that recovery image and paste on platform tools folder inside platform tool folder after paste here is click on here open command window type cmd and hit enter and this is the command window now check your devices connected on fast boot no fast boot mode or not like fast boot space devices type this enter it and as you can see this is the fast boot and fast boot on fast boot devices connected now second important command fast boot space flash space recovery space drag and drop this recovery and hit enter okay after that this recovery is installed on your device successfully now boot your device on recovery mode okay so you can use command or you can manually boot your device on fast um, custom recovery so for example i am booting my device in custom uh, recovery so how to boot type fast boot uh, space boot space drag and drop recovery and hit enter and your device boot on custom recovery which is orange fox recovery okay so here it is my device is booting on orange fox recovery after boot our device on orange fox your device shows hey this is connected as you can see our device is connected now my orange fox recovery is open on my device i will show you in later wait so we need to copy paste this files on our device or you can copy paste this files on your sd card or pen drive when we do process on orange fox recovery we need this files okay so i am pasting this files on my device okay done copy paste done and here it is the recovery interface of orange fox as we can see the file which we copy paste here as we can see now the steps we need to do check this boxes as you can see check this all boxes and swipe it check only those boxes which i selected now came on installation process select rom okay then you need to swipe it and must note one point when you swiping the rom must gapps variant if you are using vanilla version then you need to install separately google apps i mean gapps that's why i said you don't download vanilla version download gapps version rom gapps variant rom so it will take little bit of time waste wait some time after it install successfully as you can see successful messages came now came here wipe section go on format type yes then type right button the format data is done now click on uh, reboot a system okay now here it is rom install successfully ignore that red message on top successfully option is came means rom installed successfully without any issue okay now format data is also done now what is next just click on reboot system it will take some time to boot our device so wait until device will boot as we can see this is the infinity project infinity logo schemes boot animation that means rom installed successfully without any issue and it's booting so it will take some time wait okay done booting is complete now i am going to set up my device rapidly so this setup screen is came now so 
I'm going to set up this all the things rapidly. After that, I will show you the latest Android version. Okay, previously my Android version is very less. Now you able to see my Android version is Android 16 with latest security patch with good performance and good battery backup. Okay, so as you can see, yo, as you can see, yo, this is Android 15 guys and it's working very well without any issue i tested it and it's very good so if, like this you can install any latest android version custom roms so if you like this video then please like and share this video see you in the next video love you guys goodbye take care